everybody. I wanted to get on here real quick and just show you a quick and easy way to cover the back of a wreath that you've already made. So since I'm gonna cover a 10 inch wreath frame, I'm just gonna take another wreath frame that I have already, and I'm gonna use my rotary cutter. Now, only out of preference do I use the scallop edge. I just kind of feel like it adds a little bit of a flair to it, but you can use just a regular rotary cutter as well. So I don't even mark it, and I just simply will take my cutter and go around the frame It can be a little bit bigger, that's okay. Okay. You might need to go back and cut. This is just felt I buy off the bolt at your local fabric store. For me, that's either Joann's or Hobby Lobby. But if you have any fabric store that offers felt, by the bolt is what I use. So there we go. And I usually cut them, I should also add, I use a double layer so that I'll have more than just one of these felt circles. So I just fold it over like so. And then I take a pair of really sharp scissors and I will poke some holes. One, I do one, two, and then I'll do three. And then I like to poke a hole, just one here and one here, okay? So there we go, we've got our holes in our felt. So now I'm gonna get my wreath that is ready to be um, shipped out to my customers, just a sunflower wreath. Again, this is on my YouTube channel. So I'm gonna take the back of it and I'm just gonna lay my felt over top what I do like to add, if you are in business, you know, you don't have to do this if you're not in business, but I take a business card and I will add it to the wreath so that um, if your customer, you know, wants to order from you and maybe they forget who they ordered from, they can see who they ordered from on the back. So you're just going to take a four inch zip tie. So I do one here and then I'll go from the one side to the other. And just put a zip tie. I always get a lot of questions. This is one of those most frequently asked questions. In the last tutorial that I put up on YouTube, I somehow cut off the end of the video and I do apologize for that. So I figured I'm just gonna do a really quick video so that you can see what I do. I have, I have customers who actually will leave a review and comment the fact that they love the fact that I put the felt on the back of the wreath. And I just feel like it gives it a little bit of a finish touched and um, just a little added something to your wreath. Just to show you took the time to care. So, probably should have my glasses on. So once you get all of these on here, you're just going to take your cutters here and cut them all. And then we're going to bend the zip tie underneath your wreath like that. And so the next question I get is, well, where do you hang your wreath from? Well, when you have put all the zip ties in, I don't glue this to here, you can, your customer can have any point on here from the wreath frame itself to hang their wreath. So let me know if you enjoyed this video, if it was helpful. If you would like to see me maybe package a wreath and you would like to see that, let me know in the comments and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.